Alright guys, I think I just figured out the best build for Akali in Season 11. We're in what is essentially a diamond, and I'm going to be showing you a build that can genuinely 1 versus 5, um, like a Master Yi can. And it involves Conquer, it involves the new uh, version of Gumbly with the Omnivamp Rift Maker, and a new, a new component has been added. Guys, Ravenous Hydra is literally amazing on Akali. These AD hybrid um, bruiser caster builds are just so freaking good on Akali. Uh, Death Dance, if you want. You can still go for AP. But basically, Ravenous Hydra. You're going to see throughout the video just how insane it is. Infinite heals. You can't die. You do insane amounts of damage. Like, absolutely bonkers. Uh, did I get that? Oh, I should not have it. I got that one. I nice, stay away from a little bit of poke. Well done to him. He's actually doing a pretty good job uh, playing the lane out. But we're in a pretty high rank. And I wanted to test this out. I didn't want to go into like a freaking PvE game on this one. Because it's time to show off. Ranked is here. And I'm so excited for it. Um, but yeah, guys. We're running the Conquer Strategy. I can actually probably keep going. Oh my god, get turned on, you you idiot. Wait, yes, we got the cannon too. We're so destined to win this game, it's insane. Um, I should probably recall on this note though. I'm not getting that many, that's fine. Um, he should be forced to use his uh, item or his keystone to swap. I have to recall though, I simply just have to. So we're gonna be picking up this, we're gonna be picking up one of these. And wait, wait, wait for it, wait for it. Run back to lane, W boop versus gone, press E. And guys, I am just like so incredibly excited to show you this build. This is um, not your AP build with Electrocute and Night Harvester. That's insanely good for killing people and playing an assassin base Akali. But Akali is literally an AP bruiser with this build in the literal sense. Um, in every way possible. And she's a freaking, she's a really good AP bruiser at that. Um, so... Drop a ward pretty deep in here, and I'm gonna ping him. I A. I don't really know what that he could be doing. He might be helping Master E. Um, the new Scuttle Crab, if you didn't know, it has a giant shield, but if you stun it, if you stun the crab, it completely gets rid of the shield. It's like the shield's like like 70 or 80 percent of health uh, the crab has, but you can completely get rid of all thing. Oh, he lost the cannon. He was too late. I'm gonna ping him. I, I gotta spam that. Okay. And TF's going, going for health and tankiness? Sad. Sad player. You gotta go for damage, dude. How else are you gonna kill me with that when you're behind? No, I'm just kidding. He's very smart for doing that. I just ran into that, but it's fine. So I think for us, and our purposes, obviously you want to get as bad as possible. With Conquer and just uh, Riftmaker, which is the new Gunblade. It gives you AP... Uh, health and it gives you Omni Vamp. It doesn't have that passive or that unique active that gives you burst, but it is going to give you that healing that Akali wants. So we're actually going to go ahead and do a bunch of damage here. And I felt like I could get another Q in before I eat on the way out. Turret's not that fast to shoot me, but I did the maximum whilst taking only one tower shot. And obviously, you know you're going to take a tower shot when you're running into that situation, but. The aggression is the name of the game when you have a lead because we're gonna hit six soon so i'm wearing him down a little bit so when i hit six he's not gonna be full health it'll be even easier to kill him but for now i don't even want him to be blue carding honestly i want him to have to queue over and over again lose his corrupting potion okay but we're not going to get the six jump on him unless unless you might you might go for the can yeah Got it. And you know what? It's just quite literally the worst luck possible for Mastery to be doing Raptors when um, there's a lot of camps in the game, I'm not gonna lie. There's many camps in League of Legends and he just happened to be at that one. So we're gonna chalk it up to bad luck because honestly that dive was pretty good and we would have lived. Feels bad, man. But okay. 
let's go over what we're going to be picking up throughout this game. We got 50% Omni Bamp on that. We got Ravenous Hi uh, Hunter is going to have 9% uh, Spell Vamp. And then Ra Ravenous Hydra is also 15% Omni Vamp. And we get extra spells on our Q because it procs Ravenous Hydra. And that's going to be healing us whenever that uh, unique passive procs. All those little bonus AOE uh, effects, and they work with spells. You're gonna you're gonna have to see it. It's it's pretty crazy. And TF does have exhaust out. I saw that. He just did a swap. Barely missed that. Um, I'm pretty safe in this lane. Mastery is like not a real champion in terms of ganking. Um, so like we're fine. He can do really well in a longer lane that's not versus an Akali that just presses shroud. Uh, if he's trying to gank something, but him trying to get mid is just not happening. Uh, TF doesn't have the damage to help him, and Mastery is not that strong early. So, if this guy's ganking, I'm actually going to see what he's up to. Because if this guy's doing the crab, and I will just take the 10 gold then. Um, it's something, right? We're not going to get him... At least we get a little bit of a uh, golden experience off of that. Okay, and we can probably actually drop a freeze. I'm gonna set up a slight freeze. And I do want the tower to take that shot right there. But now I'm gonna auto attack. And I'm actually gonna ping, because tw it's Twisted Fate, so we don't want them to, uh... I'm gonna ping uh, them several times. You have to ping as much as possible. The more they see it, the better. Barely missed that one. But we are pretty set on this right here. Okay. Completely fine. 48 to 49. We are now beating the range champion. Okay. So he shoved, or he's uh, roaming. We just have to use our spells really quick. We, obviously, we can't follow up unless we like connect our E on him. That's never going to happen, though. And the question is... Do we go for the 2v1, or do we... Yeah, no. I, I think right here we're just going to go for uh, two plates, and that's worth a kill in itself. Plus, we get the wave, plus he misses cannon, so this is actually worth for us. Uh, even though bot lane... Yeah, bot lane's going to a lot of plates, though, so that sucks. I'm actually just going to keep autoing this until I can queue the wave. And maybe give it a more, a little bit more. Actually, very... Dude, oh my gosh. I'm not used to playing with good players in this rank. Oh, shit. Oh. Okay. I'm actually just not used to playing with good players in this rank, so... I I'm just not used to ranked uh, in Season 11. That's what I meant to say. These items are usually PvE quality, but this is actually so fun to be able to play these games. Oh, that was the... That was the real one. Okay. Alright guys, we're going to be looking to get go back and get this new Gunblade 0.5. Honestly, I prefer this Gunblade. I prefer old Gunblade, but you can't take away from the fact that it's nuts. Um, Rift Herald, Rift Maker also has this crazy uh, passive where for each second in combat, deal 3% bonus damage, max 50%. So after 5 seconds, the bonus damage is dealt as true damage instead. 15% bonus true damage. Um, yeah, Akali is literally 1v5 uh, ready. Oh gosh, I missed that. Akali can genuinely 1v5. It's going to be so sick. Okay. I'll just weaken them all a little bit. Nice, okay. My shroud's down. I should be fine here, honestly. There's like genuinely no chance I die. Oh, I'm actually annoyed. Oh. Well, you didn't see that. Okay. Huh. Well, we we don't have a team, but they do, so I will say that's kind of... That, that's okay, because once we get this Ravenous uh, Hydra, we don't need a team. Akali can roam now. 
Okay. Wait, oh, I think our team is mad at each other. You know what? I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, we're heading back into this, and I will say right now, the cool thing about Ravenous Hydra is it just, it doesn't have any bad stats, guys. It's, it's, it's so freaking good. It's not life steal, it's Omni Vamp. Oh my gosh. It's just like, it's so, and no one knows. I don't think many people know how good Ravenous Hunter Hydra is. It's so good. Alright, and just in case, okay, his exhaust is down as well, which is nice. He just changed it. Um, should be fine here. What? Holy troll. Okay. I don't know where... I don't know where Samir is. I don't want to jump him. Oh, well, there she is. Wow, she dashed it. She dashed it. We do have some kind of ability to fight. Uh, we don't. I think we should we should probably back out. Even though Shaco's TP is down, so we should be winning a fight here. Rip. I think we're gonna have to we're gonna heal on this. There we go, there we go, baby. Okay. Just gotta trust in the heals. Good job, team. And we are one step closer to the edge. And I'm about to break. Okay, um. I'm. Dude, I don't even know. If their team comp is so much AD. I think we go, um. I think we go for the plated seal caps here. And then we continue towards the, uh, Hydra. Okay. Yeah, let's grab this really quick. I'm, I feel like a noob just taking an hour and a half to look at the shop. But, you know, new season, who dis? Alright, and obviously you don't need to run to the back when you're just waiting for an item. But it's more fun to fly around. Okay, so let's go ahead and run back into this. We're doing pretty good so far. And I'm about to go pretty ham on this. Next item is going to be Demonic Embrace. Extremely strong. Uh, item as well. Dude, honestly, this this build is just so insane in team fights. It's so insane. I'm gonna pop this because I think they're all in there. I really wish he would've helped me. That's actually kind of troll that he wouldn't. Can you like auto it? Is that too much work? Uh, okay. I guess he doesn't know how a Kali works and how it takes an hour. Or maybe he's upset? I don't know. Well, he gave us the red buffs, that's all that matters. Let's just go ahead and be happy about that. Time to fight. It's time to fight. We have a Shen. His ult's up in like 10 seconds. Oh, we're not gonna get anything here. I'm trying to like... Hmm. I'd like to make something happen, but it's not, it's not going to. Alright. Yeah, sad. Not gonna happen there. Uh, Graves, nowhere to be found? Okay. Well, we'll be back in a second. Alright, so that didn't work out. I think we kinda need to just wait for our team. They're taking a very long time to do anything, but the fact of the matter is we can't be jumping in without them, so... I'm running back to help. Uh, TF's ult is down this time. No TFR. But Shen's here, so honestly it should be fine. Samira just killed our entire team. Okay. Well, let's try that again. I wonder. No. Shaco's just gonna ult. We need level 11. Okay, so we're gonna try and just auto in on three dragon on four dragons. It would be the best possible situation is to have an ocean with our team comp right here. Um I drop this. Just so they can't use it. Okay. Mastery is gone, we can go on this. We can go on this right now. I'm actually going to go on this. Mastery is just not there. We win this. She about to get this. Kill them all. Yes, good call. 
That's a triple kill because we saw Master E was gone. E gone, free win. Yes, absolutely. freaking lootly Well done, well done. Okay, let's uh, clear this out, I guess. Wait, what? Okay. Die, minions, die. You're taking forever. Okay. No worries. He might actually end for this. No, he's not. I don't think he's going to bother. Alright, we will secure it for him. No worries. Okay, thank the lords. Um, apparently, when OP Chinese Funnel Jungler Champion is gone, it's just free. Okay, so we're going to take a... Uh, what's it called? Demonic Embrace now. Also a very good item, obviously. So this. I'm just going to get health. I think it's more important than a ward. Just because um, we're, we're essentially jumping into five people every single time and they have they have one or two stuns and I think something to be said uh, right now is against a twisted fate you're not really good squishy because you get revealed by his R so you're um, you're almost always gonna be just uh, ulted and then you just instantly die because you don't have a shroud to uh, rely on All right, let's get out of here. Um, but with that said as well, uh, if you guys can tell, and I'm probably just gonna show you right now. Oh wait, never mind. Um, but yeah, every single thing you hit with your Q or any ability procs your Ravenous uh, Hydra, so you heal for just massive amounts. Like we healed a full with the Q on a minion wave of three minions. Um, but yeah, I think we need to, I think we're gonna go for red buff and just try and take that from our team. Yeah, this guy's probably not wanting to be top lane right now. Probably doesn't make sense, honestly. Yeah, I think Shen being top is a hard end. Oh, he ulted. I think it's fine. I can just heal up. I think I'm completely fine here. I have Conquer. I have so much healing. I would really like some help though. Oh man. Okay. Okay. Well, this was just such a. That was just. You just have to wait a second. And honestly, everything would have gone so much better. But we do heal to full. Oof. I'm gonna. I'm a little cringe on that one. Um. That's okay. Well, we can win this here. We can win this here easy. We'll win that, and then we just have to try and figure it out from there. No auto? Okay. Alright, we're gonna press Q on this wave through 352. It's more healing than Season 10. It's literally more healing. Um, thank you. Okay, we can actually Baron here. We can Baron. TF is bot, yeah, yeah, I take it. And he, of course he's gonna use the shield that way. Of course he's gonna use the shield that way every single time. And I wanna save my R2 so I can help do Baron. I miss barely, that sucks. Um, I wanna do as much damage as possible to this thing, because Master is coming and I don't trust my jungler. To e you never wanna trust your jungler to smite, it's just a bad idea. So get this as fast as possible. You don't wanna recall until Baron, buddy. Because now it's five, we're gonna get there faster. Fine. No worries. We do take that. Everything is fine. We are literally becoming the monster that I t said we would, uh, what is it, 20 minutes ago? It's just so obscene. It's so beautiful. And now we have enough. We're just going to... Wait, wait. Let's actually grab this really quick, and then I'm going to grab this. Uh, do we have time for... Do we have time between dragon? All right, we're back, team. We are gonna grab the freaking demonic embrace, and everything we could want is here. So let's recap: fifteen percent bonus damage, bonus damage on Rift Maker, true damage. We got Ravenous Hydra is going to give us a Omni Vamp as well. Omni Vamp on that. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. We can't actually recap right now. 
I literally can't move. Wow, I actually couldn't move on that. I was just perma CC'd. All right, well, we're back and essentially Conquer, Rift Maker, Demonic Embrace. All of these things are going to be popping off four or five seconds in. And it is going to be good. It's going to be good. That's all I got. Um, I probably should have focused a little bit more on that last fight. We might be able to actually pick up some kills. But Soraka did hard int on that and brought us with her. What the fuck did she press R for? Okay. Yeah, she might She might be a little... Uh, ah, she might be trolling or something. Ooh, and the Grave's going in a little too deep as well. I think we can, we can actually turn on this one. Kill the, kill the Samira. Anyone else, I outheal that. Uh, it's just Master Use damage is immense. And please tell me a flash. Oh. The barrier when she's not even there. That's okay. No worries. It's it's gonna work out for us. It's all gonna work out. Just grab that, grab, inhib, quick. We're chilling. I think we're chilling here. Alright, and now they should be fine if they just run. Okay, what do we want? Um, okay, we might not be fine, but TF ulted, right? So that's something. I think we can actually probably, without TF ult, I think an MF or Master Yield. ult, I think we can actually just win this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill them all. I think I'm gonna go for it. I think we are simply strong enough to defend against this. Shen's ult is down, but that doesn't really matter. <laughs> Even the freaking E just does the, the weird AoE from Hydra. So funny. Nice, and the burn's gonna pick that up. All these synergies as well, the freaking uh, burn from our Rift Maker. It's gonna proc off of our Ravenous Hydra, just so much. Uh -oh. Okay, oh, that's not good. Got the thousand. Got the thousand. Oh my gosh, we're popping up. That's fine. I'm gonna kill him. Where are they? Hmm. I'm not exactly sure about this. I'm not so confident I'd win it. I'm just gonna be patient. They can't push without minions. I'm actually just gonna ride this. Hold the phone. Okay. Even if Botling shows up. Yeah, I figured he'd take that. We need to get this dragon. We need to get that dragon. We're gonna go for Void Staff and um, oh, oh, good luck. I, I'm actually not going to chase that. I, I'd rather get my Void Staff and commit to winning this next fight. And this guy is low now? Okay. Um, they have super fast Baron. We should take this right now. Force 5v5 before drag. Uh, or else that put us in a really tough decision. Or we get in tough decision. If we get the, if we just force this now, they kind of have to come, and this is really risky of me. But if I can get a lot of damage right now, just start it, just start it, trade, trade, go. There we go again. We got the Baron, they got the Dragon, that's fine. Um, just get this, get this. No worries, no worries. Hmm. Just 
Should be fine here. Oh my gosh, I freaking I was swinging my auto. Damn. My bad. Also, it's uh, they I guess they had a lot of vision to see that literally not a single teammate was near me. I thought that might have been a little aggressive by them, but I guess we'll have to I'll have to get them next time. Alrighty guys, we are preparing for battle yet again. I think we should probably stay pretty close to our team now. Uh, we have Baron for a good amount of time. Oh, he he ult he used a stun. That's a free one. Oh man. Oh, that's so annoying. I failed. I failed. I thought I could flash over that wall. And I don't know if this is gonna work because they they haven't mastered E, and I think I have to do everything. Yeah. That is definitely gonna happen when you're a one-man team, that's for sure. We might actually lose. I'm voting no. I'm voting no. We can do it. We can carry. Nah, I don't think we can. I think it's actually over. No. So sad. Guys, I am so sad. This is the best build, but the worst team, and I messed up a few times, so that sucks too. Guys, this build is amazing. Last item was gonna be Cosmic Drive. Please, do me a favor, hit that like button. I never upload losses, so I actually really wanted to. And I think that gameplay was really good as well. It's just, it happens. I didn't play perfectly, and I'll take responsibility for that as well. But guys, I hope you enjoyed regardless. Comment down below what build you want to see next, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.